Thank you, Chairman, and thank you for your report. Uh, three comments on the conclusions. One is, uh, it is stated here that uh, public procurement rules alone account for 43% of all quantifiable errors. I wonder if the European Court of Auditors has identified what is the essential problem, lack of clarity of rules or maybe cultural problems around the different member states that influence the way they implement uh, the existing rules. On uh, your conclusion number three, uh, you refer to the protection to, of whistleblowers. In fact, you call for the Commission to promote more efficient reporting rules and invite to provide clear rules on uh, protection for whistleblowers. Well, we had a study one month ago and the number of MEPs assisting to the hearing was the same as today. Uh, I don't think much importance is given to whistleblowers at EU level, so uh, I think it's, to, it's high expectation to believe that the uh, European Commission is going to make any sensible contribution in this, in this area. Uh, and finally, uh, but more importantly, in point number six, you call for the, uh, replacing the balance sheets with cash flow statements. Well, I would say that we have to complement the balance sheets with the cash flow statements, but never abandon the, the, the balance sheets because this is the legal document on which we have to base our uh, evaluations. Uh, I understand that uh, now, because of all that's going on with Greece, we have started to have certain skepticism about balance sheets. But uh, balance sheets remain the most important document on which uh, the indicators have to be measured. Thank you.